What were you trying to do, kill yourself? That would make it easier for you, wouldn't it? You had no business driving in your condition. You should have taken my keys away from me. You were drunk, JR. You could have hurt somebody in my car. But I didn't. I hit a tree. So, are you gonna have me arrested? Maybe I should have you locked up. Well, that'd be great. Mm -hmm. Take away my freedom. You've already taken yeah. everything else from me. Well, it would me. give you a chance to sober up. Well, don't act like you give a damn. Not after poisoning my own son against me. AJ doesn't want to talk to you because he's scared of you. The way you get when you've been drinking. I'm his father, damn it. Yes, and he misses his father. Not this nasty, stumbling drunk that he doesn't even recognize. This is all on you, JR. Just you. Hey, my son loves me. Me. You understand? He loves who you were, not this person. Well, that's a bunch of crap. AJ would never stay away from me if you hadn't been filling his head full of lies. I can't talk to you. That's fine. Why don't you two go off and do, uh, whatever you people do? We people? Yeah. I'll tell you something you're not going to do. Let's keep my son away from me. End of discussion. I was worried that this would happen, so, uh, I had a judge issue a temporary restraining order. Wait, what? Until you go to rehab? and prove to the court that you can be a responsible parent. I have full-time custody of AJ. Looking at the baby, at some point she's gonna realize that this is her baby that she is holding. Well, first things first. You have to focus and concentrate on finding Hayward. I can't. Come on, Jake. I can't. This is gonna end badly. I can feel it. I need to tell Angela the truth. And I need to tell her now. I can't believe that you would do this to me. We have a court date in a couple of weeks. It's right there in the paperwork. Oh, court date. If you can show up and prove that you're getting help and prove that you're getting sober, I have no problem returning to our joint custody what? You arrangement. You don't have a problem? You don't have a problem? Who the hell do you think you are? You're easy, JR. No, you back off. It's none of your damn business. Yeah, it is my business. And if you don't back off, Chief of Police is right over there. <sighs> I don't care. JR, you better care about turning this around, because if you don't, I will sue for permanent custody. I'll see you in hell first. JR. Come on, Marissa. That's right, go. Both of you get on my side. Hi, I need to talk to you. Yeah, come on in. Um, what is it? What's wrong? I I just came from seeing Jr. and it was really bad. It's really really bad. What happened? Marissa got a temporary injunction for full custody of AJ, at least until Jr. straightens himself out. And that couldn't have gone over well. No, no, he almost lost it on her. I've never seen this side of him. I hate what the alcohol is doing to him, but I have to protect our son. Well, of course you Right, do. you know, our poor little boy. Okay, two will be fine. Okay, we'll make sure of that. We all will. Marissa, you did the right thing. I didn't know any other way. As much as I love JR, I mean, he's been like a son to me ever since he was a little baby. He is a Chandler, which means he's one of those people that doesn't recognize a problem until it hits him straight between the eyes. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm going to be fine. JR is... Uh... JR is sick. Nobody can help him. I mean, if he can't even get sober for his own son. Shh. Hey, baby, how are you? I'm sorry, I thought you were upstairs with Opal and the girls. I heard you crying, Mommy. I'm sorry, baby, come here. Look, I was a little sad before, but I'm okay now. Especially now I'm seeing you. What is it? What's wrong? I miss my daddy. Not the mean one, the nice one. Come here. I don't want your daddy to get better. Well, why isn't he? Sometimes your daddy gets really mad at himself when things don't go the way that he wants them to. So he will say and do things that he doesn't really mean. 
Like yelling? Yeah, exactly, like yelling. But you know that when he isn't feeling bad, he doesn't do those things. Well, maybe I can help him. No, sweetheart, no. Maybe if I be really, really nice to him, he'll be okay again. I mean, he already knows that you're the nicest boy in the whole world. You know, the only person that can help Daddy get better right now is Daddy. You must 